people think just that if their kid has a phone that has 4G on it, that that's enough for the household. And I think anyone in this room, we couldn't function if all we had was one device at home that had 4G speeds. I mean, you can't apply for a job, you can't write a resume, you can't communicate effectively with doctors or family, whatever it might be. So I think part of it is to go into communities and actually see what is going on, and that, that's hard work. I mean, it's, there's no, I don't think there's a magic bullet. Uh, I mean, it, I did mention earlier the system is broken. It's, I, I personally don't think that just because you're wealthy, you should have better internet than someone who isn't wealthy. You don't get better electricity. I think you found in Flint, Michigan, the problem when you get better water that was such an incredible disaster. And I think that's what's going on with the internet is, and I, I praise internet essentials, but on the other end of it, it's not fast enough. It's not fast enough. And it's improved, and when it started, what did it start at, like one meg or something? One and a half? So it's come a long way, <laughs> it's 10 times faster now. Um, but it needs to be much faster than that. I don't know if that fully answered your question, but. Uh.